if I were stuck on a desert island, which three companions, like Brock, Brock, May, uh, well, maybe I'd take Ash's mom, because she'd cook. <laughs> what? Oh, Brock can cook. Maybe we wouldn't need anybody else. Um, Mr. Mime. <laughs> maybe we'll do that. Yeah, no, not Professor Oak, yeah. Do you have any bloopers you're particularly proud of? Um, I, you know, I don't do a lot of... I mean, obviously I do make mistakes and uh, mess up, but I don't really do a lot of bloopers, and I don't really do a lot of them on purpose, because really, when you're in the studio, there's no time to be messing up at all. So, um, no, not really. But I will say that, um, in terms of wasting time, uh, one time when I was at work, and I was working on his and her circumstances, and Yukino had this very long scream, and so I decided to just keep going until the whole, as the whole picture went. But you can't breathe and scream at the same time. So I was screaming, ah, she's going and going. And then I stopped, and then I fainted. So <laughs> that's a time waster right there. Um, so that is probably the best uh, slash worst thing that's ever happened to me while I've been recording. But overall, I don't really have anything. Um, I, I, yeah. I don't really like to say anything, like if you're saying, if you're doing something in the voice of Ash, and Ash wouldn't really swear, so as Ash I wouldn't really like to do that, because who knows where it would go. Um, so, not really, not so much. Say something for me, please. Say something for you? Hi. <laughs> oh, that's not what you meant? <laughs> um, as Ash, you mean? When I grow up, I want to be a Pokemon master! <laughs> I am grown up. Yep. <laughs> Are there any Pokemon you find a bit creepy? Well, I know a lot of people think Mr. Mime is creepy. <laughs> um, I really like him. Um, I find it comforting. He doesn't talk at all. He does a lot of housework. Um, but there are... No, for the most part, you know, and also you can keep them a bit at arm's length, so, um, I know, I don't, do you? Do you have some? Yeah, when I was five, I used to be really scared of Jinx. <laughs> oh, yeah, that is kind of a weird one, actually. That's not on very much, I don't think. Yeah. As a voice actor, when you see characters that you do on TV, can you, like, see them as a different character to you, or is it always in the back of your mind that that's your voice? Um, I am able to kind of distance myself from that, um, especially for, like, when we've watched Pokemon, I really don't think about, oh, I should have said that line differently or whatever, because the, I feel for that the character really takes on its, his own self. Um, maybe if I saw myself in a live action, I'm a bit more critical, but, um, yeah, with a cartoon, I kind of give it over to seeing the character and I can forget it's me. To some, yeah. But that's an interesting question, though. Two things. Question 